Hey guys, welcome to the channel Cyber Fixer. This channel was made as a last stand option for those who needs to fix when in doubt. I'm Q and let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome back to another Cyber Fixer video. Today we're going to be doing a part two video to the video I explained about um, the hard drive space having issues and you know, the system giving you random errors because it's saying that you don't have enough space. So I'm going to show you how to actually clear that room off the system for that hard drive instead of me just telling you how I did in the last video. Because I'm pretty sure you guys saw when I got up and I was like, oh, hold on, let me go check. All right, so let's get right into this. All right, guys, so first things first, you want to go to the main menu. At the bottom, press the PlayStation button. This menu will show up. Go all the way to the bottom to the power button. Click the power button. Turn off PS5. Then we wait. Next, you want to hold the power button until you hear the second beep. Once the second beep comes on, you can let go and wait for the system to boot up. Step 3. Once the system boots up, you are going to need to connect your PlayStation controller via USB to the system. Go down to step number five, clear cache and rebuild database, and then number one, clear system software cache and press OK and then just wait. Once this starts it's going to shut the system down it's going to start clearing the cache on its own you just wait until it does what it needs to do just be patient. Once it boots back up everything should be good to go then you can go ahead and try to Reinstall the games you were trying to reinstall on that big hard drive of yours and see if it actually works. If this does not work, then that means you have already used up all the space possible on that drive. Thanks for watching. 